everybody. Welcome back. We're out here at the Strawberry Festival in downtown Terre Haute, and a lot of people have been coming by already today, and I've got Zeke with me here. you got some numbers on what's going on about numbers, but people and uh, what they've had. Right. Well, people are just happy to be back here. They're expecting actually record-breaking amounts of 10,000 people by the time the day ends, but don't worry, Jesse. They're prepared. 7,300 pounds of strawberries ordered and over uh, nearly 11,000 biscuits. However, I got ice cream earlier. The weather was not friendly. Melted pretty quick, but overall, <laughs> a great time. But you like the food. Fantastic. First time out here, I'll be back. All right, sounds good. Hey, I'm going to tell Gwen, come on in here. I got Gwen Hicks, who's in charge of the, the event. Uh, we're winding down. We're in the last hour, so let's talk about the crowd. Been good today. Oh, it's been amazing. I mean, we've been steady all day, and look at the line still lined up. We're, we're here for another half an hour, but we want people to come out and have their first taste of summer and enjoy the rest of the day. It's been a great weather day. How much uh, does it cost? It's $6 for the works, okay. and you can get in any line, and there's no calories because it's a church function. <laughs> uh, but yeah, just come on out and enjoy at 630 Ohio, First Congregational Church. One last thing, you couldn't do this without some help, right? Oh, our amazing, incredible volunteers. Every line, serving line, is all manned with volunteers, and we've, we've been so blessed to have them come out and help us. But you know, you said there's a line, but the line's moving, so don't be discouraged if you see the line. They're getting through quick. Oh, no, come in. You've got a half an hour to get out here, and we're moving through fast. That's it. We've got a new system, and it's working well this year. Glad we're back this year. Oh, we're glad to be back. Yes, right, thank, thank you. Thank you. All right, let's talk about what Weather. Hey, earlier today I was down in Worthington, Indiana, and uh, speaking to a summer camp down there about weather and also safety tips. So there you go. That's my group down in Worthington. Had a great time talking to those kids earlier today. Next up, let's talk about the weather and what's going on across the area for us today. We've seen a lot of cloud cover moving into the area. The cloud cover, though, is not actually producing any, uh, any precipitation. Our high and low temperatures for the day today, we actually got up to around 80 degrees for the daytime high. We started out kind of cool, dropping down into the 50s. So mid-50s, 56 was our low early this morning. It was a little cool out there early on. Uh, we've not gotten any rain, so in precipitation, you'll see there's nothing showing up as far as any rain across the area. Some people out here have been asking because it looks like it could rain, but we really don't see any of that going on, at least until probably late, late overnight. Here's what we've got now as we take you out to Terre Haute and the uh, airport. Temperatures are not bad, actually. The cloud cover is keeping temperatures in check pretty much in the 70s all across the area. we got kind of a west to northwest breeze, so things are looking pretty good. Temperatures all across the area right now. Again, very nice for this time of the year. Uh, very pleasant. That breeze is kind of helping as well. So you'll see the temperatures across the region look very nice, pretty much in the 70s across the area. Here's the water vapor satellite. There's deeper moisture west of this area. That's moving our way. And on the national satellite and radar, you'll see the clouds thickening off to the west of the area. We're going to zoom in and give you a closer look. And you'll see the clouds are really starting to thicken west and move this way. So eventually, we're going to see some rain. But when you take a look at the Dorset Automotive Doppler radar, you won't find any rain in the immediate area, so it's going to be a little while before we see that start to get in. We're going to show you the next 48 hours, and we'll put this in motion, and you'll see some rain chances developing by tomorrow morning. Uh, the rain will probably be fairly light tomorrow. I don't think it's anything big, and most of that's going to be over by tomorrow evening. So over the next 48 hours, we'll see that rain chance tomorrow. That leaves tomorrow evening, and then we're looking pretty good as we head for the upcoming weekend. So. Let's take a look at the forecast for tonight, then. We're looking for basically partly cloudy skies and mild weather tonight. Tomorrow, then, we'll be back probably around 70 with some rain chances. And then by the weekend, it looks nice. But get this, we've got hot weather. Temperatures could be close to 100 by next week. That's a wrap on the forecast. Strawberry Festival going on until 7 o'clock here in downtown Terre Haute. Hi, you know.